Hey, hello there, and a very, very warm welcome. Um, I'm extra excited tonight. Good evening. It is, uh, of course, a Planet Cruise TV show. My name's Sean Ryan, but it's a very special show because we are celebrating our 10th anniversary. I remember sitting here 10 years ago. Do you know, I've not even been on a cruise at that point, but I presented the show, and I thought, oh, I like the sound of that. Uh, since then, I've been very lucky. I've actually done 25 cruises. Tonight's show is exceptional. We've actually got 13 different offers for you. If you're quick booking, we've got loads of freebies like free speciality restaurants or champagne in your room. So it's going to be exceptional. We've got some brilliant guests. Justin's going to be with me, Ruth from Celebrity as well. But I thought it'd be a bit of fun to have a look back at the past 10 years. Here we go. Well, can I just say a very, very good evening to you. I'm so excited. The amazing Cruise Holiday Show with Planet Cruise. I've been joined by Keith. Nice Hi. to meet you, Keith. He was the entertainment director. He's a funny man. That's just good. Nice to see you. Stop laughing. Just as we've had a stressful day. It's something special. Something special coming up. I'll start planning a holiday of a lifetime. Ruth, love to see you back on the show. Thank you, it's lovely to be back. This handsome young man, Luke, is going to tell us all about Carmel. Right. Alicia's with us from MSC. Nice to see you guys. Very excited to be here. Right, we would spend the evening together, I shouldn't say that. We, no. No. we were in a nice <laughs> yeah. venue in the evening. We've got Jessica with us again. Jessica, lovely to see you. Uh, Moira from Cruise Hello, Hello. 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 This is what Christmas is like in the Caribbean. So I'm very, very lucky to have worked all over the planet, been off the shore and explored all of these ports of course. So you worked full time for Planet. Yeah. And you spent years in the cruise industry, didn't you? I did, 10 years in the end. Well, we haven't changed at all in 10 years, obviously. <laughs> in fact, nice to... 10 years ago, I just stepped foot off of a cruise ship and come on land. Seriously. 10 years, how quick it wow. goes. It does go so fast. It just ends with us. Great to have your company tonight. Um, <laughs> yeah, the 10 years have been amazing. Do you know the cruise industry has changed so much in that time? I think it's got yeah. better and better and better. Yeah, and everybody thought it was going to get bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. It's, it has got better. There's more choice. There's more diversity, which gives us, you know, a problem as, yeah. as a cruise uh, operator. You know, we, we are the, the UK's largest on TV and um, over 25 different cruise lines. You know, we're topped wow. with majority of the big names just like uh, celebrity i know ruth's going to be here tonight she's she's been saying that you know we, we are number one when it comes to the booking so you know um, we're doing something right so tonight honestly i mean i'm not being funny but everyone wanted to be on the show so everyone's put forward their best and biggest deals and we've got exclusives for you the only thing is we're 10 years older, but we're going to have to be super quick and fast tonight. <laughs> so well, it's you know, got a lot to get through. It's, it's a good point on that one. For those of you who are watching tonight, we are going to be quite quick. It's just showing you, you know, the highlights. So, so the number at the bottom of the screen, just jot that down. And if you see anything that you like, or even if you just see anything you don't like, then just give the guys yeah. a call. Because then you can say, oh, that P&O deal that's on TV right now, they'll be able to find it, trust me. Yeah, so uh, we'd better crack on. Um, by the way, can I say a big thank you to Sean that made this amazing cake as yeah. well. It's... We, th we, we have got a knife to cut it later, haven't we? <laughs> There's enough there None. for me and you, isn't there, I think? Yeah. But... Just the top two. <laughs> <laughs> but um, we, we're going to start because... Um, it's very important, if you book early tonight, there are loads of extras, OK, for yes. the first bookings. So we'll tell you about those as we go along. But this uh, the first cruise is with the amazing P&O. Yeah, my very Good own friends cruise of yours. Uh, yeah. Six years of P&O, uh, not a bad word to say about it. And this particular deal, again, the first ten bookings with this particular deal will receive a P&O Cruises branded bottle of wine. Um, uh, so, you know, if, if you are a big P&O fan, especially with the Ventura, she's an absolute beautiful ship. She was named by um, um, Helen Mirren. Um, so, you know, they always get fantastic uh, godmothers. She's a beautiful ship. And, you know, the grand class that she is, they've tweaked her from the American market and it really does um, make a difference. The atrium is fantastic. You know, the signature P&O touches are there. Great for the families as well. And, and certainly they've, they've actually got Scale Electric at sea there. They've got 3D cinemas. They've got circus training as well as Cirque Ventura as well. Uh, now, I, I recognize that restaurant. 
Uh, yes, yeah, similar to the one that's on Britannia, yes. which is Sindhu. Yeah, this, uh, I mean, of course, P&O has got a massive history with India. Uh, and the food on board, when we talk about it, they used to have curry night, and then it became so popular, they've actually done a restaurant on it. Um, so some fantastic, and talking of food, Marco Pierre White's got the, uh, the white room on here. And but, I gather we've got a celebrity on board on some of the dates as well, haven't we? Yeah, certainly. If you do like your, uh, your food, then Atoll Kutcher will be on board the 20th of July, the 20th of July departure date. So if you want to be on board uh, with celebrity chef Atul Kutcher, then uh, please book that date. But where you're going is fantastic. You're leaving Southampton, and certainly P&O, they do the Great British Sailor Way. You'll love that. Lovely day at sea before Vigo. Now, this is a lovely port to start the cruise off with. Uh, the Cascavello is the best place to have a wander around. But, of course, if you want to go farther afield, you can go to Santiago de Compostela. Then we're into Lisbon, one of my favourite ports, and Portugal is popular. You dock underneath the 25th of April Bridge. You've got to go into town and have a look around the trams. Uh, but there's plenty to see and do on the actual quayside. This is not far from the Bell M Tower, uh, which you, you can actually stroll from the ship. So go and see and do that. Then we're into Porto, and as the name suggests, Porto is the home of Port. Of and as you uh, actually as you go into the town, you'll see the uh, the bridge which was designed by Gustav Eiffel. Um, and, uh, of course, then on the hillside, you get all of the big port manufacturers uh, displaying their wares. So uh, really good. There. There's some great uh, heritage when it comes to um, artwork here as well, but you'll have to research that a little bit more. Then we've got a lovely day at sea, and then we've got our uh, port, which is our anchorage port, uh, which is St. Peter Port. So a shore on a tender. Do you great know, I, I loved Guernsey. Yeah, yeah. So like I said, it's one of those great places oh, that when you get in there, um, you have a little bit of wander around. Great with silver, great with uh, World War II. Um, uh, so if you want to go out and see some of the sites, because of course it was the only part of the UK, I believe, that was occupied. I'm not too sure whether that was... Yes, it was Guernsey and, and the, the Channel Lines. Anyway, history was never my strong point. <laughs> Potter! <laughs> Cruising is that. Then we're back to Southampton. <laughs> Let's round that one up rather quickly. And that ends up at £78 per person per night. And that is just a deposit of 15%. Now, it does... Uh, it, it, it does pay to book early tonight. The first 10 bookings, are just to mention, will receive a P&O, a brand new bottle of wine as well. Uh, we have got Atul Kutcher on board on the 20th of July as well. The itineraries will depend uh, and vary slightly just on departure dates, but we can talk you through. And uh, don't forget, we've got a brilliant relationship with the Holiday Inn in Winchester. Oh, do you want it. Yeah. Want, yeah. Yeah, if you're travelling a long distance, do it because it includes all your parking and your port transfers, and it's a lovely way to stay home. Yeah, it is. Uh, and we've got some, obviously, we've got some brilliant prices tonight, so many exclusive offers. So this one starts at just 539 What I would say, though, um, really worth upgrading. We look at it's only a few pounds extra per night for an outside, and the balcony is looking really good there at 689 um, I know the phone lines are going to be super busy tonight, so do bear with us, but 080 250 2662. Ah, uh, now. Hey, first one down, only another 12 to go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now I was going to say, Ruth is about, Ruth's going to be joining us in a few months' time with Celebrity. That's not, that's not the sound effect for Ruth coming that's on. every by week is a different <laughs> sound effect. Yeah, yeah. It's the fire alarm yeah. now. <laughs> now that one, uh, that means we've got some specials coming up right now. Yes. Have a look at these and January special deals. Remember, it's the Planet Cruise January sale. We've got a seven-night Easter in Ryan sign from Tilbury uh, from just £539. This was a cruise and maritime on the Magellan. You get to see Amsterdam, the Isles of Scilly, Guernsey, Honfleur and Tilbury as well. It's just a fantastic and, deal. And I know because we haven't got long, these are going to be super fast. So if you can jot down the ID numbers at home, that would make it even better. So that one there is uh, 125164. The second January sale deal that I've got for you is the Seven Night Rome Monte Carlo and Corsica from Malta with P&O again. And that has an amazing price at just 689 departing on the 19th of April. Trust you to get the posh one. Well, that's, that's a really good deal for those ports. It's great. It's lovely. Though. Yeah, fantastic. Anyway, it wouldn't be a 10th anniversary with Planet Cruise without this fibrous lady, great friend of ours, Ruth from Celebrities with us. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Wonderful to be back. Cheers, but by the way. While I was just waiting to come on, did you know I was your very first Cruise Line guest on Planet I Cruise TV that. as well? So it's uh, wonderful to be now, here for the 10th anniversary. 
Ruth, you're always one to make an entrance. What have you done <laughs> with this? <laughs> Just a small award. Well, actually, last week was the uh, Travel Industry Awards, the Globe Awards, and we were voted Best Premium Cruise Line for the eighth year in a row. So we are wow. so proud of that. But also, it was a fabulous week of awards because at Celebrity, we had our cruise awards and awarded our top trade partners and number one agent for Celebrity Cruises again. Guess who? Uh, Planet, Planet Cruise. Cruise. Sorry, so yeah. congratulations I stole you thought I told to them all. <laughs> um, so, I mean, and as many of you know, I, ten years ago, I'd not cruised with Celebrity. I've, I've mm -hmm. now, I think I've done eight cruises with you. you have. And I've got my ninth book coming in up March. when? In March. Oh, yeah. More than me. <laughs> no, there's something wrong with that, that. There's something really wrong. But I, I'm, I am a massive fan. Um, you are. You know, seriously, if you've never cruised celebrity, you've got to try. And you've got us a brilliant deal tonight, haven't you? Well, we certainly have. But before that, 10th anniversary, we had to give you something so special. And we don't give these away to anybody. Well, it's a, a competition to win a mini cruise. It is. Let's tell you a bit about it. How would you like to win a fabulous two-night modern luxury cruise sailing on the 28th of April 2018 to La Havre on board the stunning Celebrity Silhouette, courtesy of Planet Cruise and Celebrity Cruises? Well, we're giving one lucky viewer the chance to win this incredible prize for two people staying in a balcony cabin and enjoying free drinks and free gratuities. And for your chance to win, you simply go to planetcruise.com and when you get there, all you need to do is follow the instructions. It will take you a couple of minutes at most. That's our lovely Keith who uh, is saying a big hello to each and every one of you tonight. Now, Ruth, this is your favourite ship, isn't it, tonight? It is, Silhouette. I should never really say that out loud, but it is true. It is my favourite ship well, in the and, fleet. And your favourite itinerary as well. Well, it's actually our most popular itinerary. We run itineraries right through from May till August, but this is a very special Scandinavia and Russia on Celebrity Silhouette, her maiden season from the UK. Some wonderful features on board that you may not have experienced before, such as the beautiful Lawn Club Grill. You can uh, choose your own steak, grill with the chef, dine al fresco. The alcove's there for some secluded, peaceful time with butler service, drinks, cheese and wine platters. The porch, a gorgeous seafood restaurant with lobster and mahi-mahi and prawns dining al fresco. And then a really wonderful secluded hideaway called The Hideaway, as you can see there. There are some wonderful secluded pods you can snuggle in with a good book and a delicious coffee. But all of the wonderful features you know and love at Celebrity are there. Cuisine restaurant, Tuscan grill, aqua class date rooms, all the things you love about Celebrity are on Silhouette. Do you know, this sounds a bit silly to say, but I actually felt quite emotional watching that clip. Oh. There's so many memories with flooding yes. back there, you know? Um, Absolutely. And whichever ship you book with Celebrity, they're all amazing. But, they are. Uh, the itinerary tonight is an itinerary that I still haven't done. And it's <gasps> your most popular, isn't it? Well, tonight is the night to book, well, it isn't is. it? What's the date? 7th of May, 12 <laughs> nights yeah. to Scandinavia and Russia about, about from About six weeks after my last cruise, but I can try you to squeeze, squeeze it in. in. So uh, where, where are we cruising to then, guys? First of all, we're actually off to Christensen. This is one of your favourite ports, isn't it? It is. Definitely. Well, in Christian Sand, it's traditional wooden houses, very Norwegian, very traditional, Gothic cathedral. It's actually known as the town of flowers. Absolutely beautiful. Stan, it's got a really good uh, cannon museum as well. You've got the Fisherman Street and a vintage railway. All recommend there. Then we're to Copenhagen. Copenhagen, I absolutely love. I'd love to go back just, just for a couple of days because you've got these wonderful restaurants and bars down by the waterfront. And then you head into town. You've got little things like the Little Mermaid. You can go get pictures of but Tivoli. Gardens is an absolute must because they've got some fantastic things there uh, and definitely a highlight of the cruise. I don't know what it is, but and the we're little there overnight. Oh, you are? Aren't you? Yes. Just to say, it's a little mermaid. Always reminds me of you. Oh, <laughs> she is tiny. I'll she give you that. To be she fair, is. here's my top tip safe Tivoli Gardens for the evening because it's yes. beautiful at night. Uh, is, then you've got a relaxing day at sea and then we're into Tallinn. Now, Tallinn. Uh, again, one of my favourite Baltic ports that you got here. Uh, you've got the palaces you can go to, but to be fair, the old town and the actual square with the, the town hall, that town hall there has got uh, many memories for me. Beautiful flower market there, and the, the actual uh, bars and restaurants around the, uh, the square itself. It's worth, worth going there. It's a little bit more expensive, but it's great for people watching. And if you've got great weather there, everybody thinks that the Baltic's going to be cold. It's no. absolutely stunning. Wonderful Stunning, weather. beautiful. Tallinn reminds me of Cinderella. Yes, yes. yes we'll it's a fairy tale, isn't it? 
Um, then we're off to St. Petersburg. Now, ah. I, I surprised Ruth earlier on because Ruth doesn't think that I'm very cultured, but every time that I used to go <laughs> to St. Petersburg, um, I, I, did, I did the hermitage. You have to do that because yes. you'll, ne you'll never get to see it all in one day. I think no. you could spend three months there and no, you know, still not see it. But for me, in the evening, and you are there overnight, yes. you've got to go to the ballet. Yes. And I just love the live music. I love the performance. You've got the Church of the Spilt Blood there, the great Russian markets where you can buy anything, anything milita militaralia, so you can buy the old Russian submarine hat. Caviar. Stuff like that. Yeah, caviar. Uh, a little bit of Stolish and as well. Other brands are available. Just there is so good. much to see and do. You really will pack your full mm. two days. Uh, then we're off to uh, Helsinki, and, and certainly with, with Finland, they, they absolutely love their design, and, and the beauty of the sailing is worth getting up early. Get up early and sailing on this one. I mean, just enjoy enjoy this wonderful port. port. The neoclassical buildings are just stunning, and there's good shopping here as well, really good shopping. Uh, then we're off to Skagen. Now, this is Denmark. This it is another is. one of your favourites. It absolutely is. It's actually renowned for its beautiful, powdery, white, sandy beaches, and which you don't you think know. of on a Scandinavian mm. and Russian yeah. cruise. There's lots of museums. It is full of artists and art galleries. And actually, it was occupied by the Germans in World War II. So there is a lot of history here in Denmark. Yeah, the Banks by Forts one to, to go and yes. see. And you said about um, artwork. There's 1,800 works of art, actually, at the Skagen Art Museum. So it's plain mm. to see and do that. Uh, now, you have a final day at sea. And I've got to say, I love the days at sea with celebrity. I really do. <laughs> I mean. I sometimes, that is a brilliant item, but sometimes I do have to force myself to get off the ships because this is what you're going to experience today. Well, exactly. And no matter whether you choose to do some of it, all of it, or none of it, it's just a beautiful ship. There you can see our gorgeous Lawn Club grill that I was uh, talking about before. If the weather is wonderful, you've got the beautiful Lawn Club that you can relax outside in the sunshine or the gorgeous pool area. If it's not so great, then you have got the indoor solarium, which is adults, adults only. only. Mm. We love that. The hideaway, so you can snuggle with your gorgeous coffee and a good book. Our famous martini ice bar. I don't know if we've got a picture, uh, but we've got over 50 different flavors and brands of vodka and martini. All of the different specialty restaurants, they are so sumptuous and, and so affordable. You've they got really one of the are. Best wine collections at sea as well. We've By actually the got the well. largest and rarest wine yeah. collection at sea. So wonderful, wonderful. For me, though, Ruth, I, I really think it's the itinerary on this one because the it fact is. that you get the overnight in St. Petersburg yes. to enjoy that and the overnight in Copenhagen and, as well. Yes. Can I just say price wise this actually came down today? It didn't did. It? It's come down quite considerably yeah, today on the inside staterooms. Um, honestly it's I mean the last price was, was far higher than that. It's nearly £1,400. Yes. So it's come down right now. Uh, you've also got that great prize job. Now I, I love the, the classic drinks package as many of you know. It's the best mm -hmm. drinks package at sea in my opinion. And you will get that free with port parking on an ocean view and above. So I think that's going to yes. absolutely fly. Price wise, let's just show you how affordable this is time. Now, uh, so I do apologize, we've got quite a few sellouts already. We please. have. It's such an incredibly popular itinerary. Now, the 7th of May is the itinerary we've been talking about, which is 12 nights. Notice from an ocean view to balcony, it's £120. That's £10 per person per night to upgrade to a balcony. The remaining itineraries from the 26th of May through to the 4th of August are various uh, itineraries. They're all Scandinavia and Russia. They're all 14 nights. Some include three days in St. Petersburg. Some have overnight in Stockholm. Some overnight in uh, Copenhagen. A variety, but you can see by the number of yeah. sellouts there, you yeah. have to be quick for the remaining stateroom. Um, now, Ruth. Yes. Can we talk about Aqua Class? We've both done it now, haven't we, we Aqua we Class? Have. It's the only way to travel. Um, for me, having the blue restaurant yes. every night for breakfast and dinner was yes. worth every single penny. It's Amazing. It's wonderful to have a small restaurant, intimate, and they will even cook off menu for you. Yeah. Nothing is too much I was going to say, a friend of mine had a few dietary requirements. Yes. Wasn't a problem. What about you, Persian Garden? Oh, I did. We had a wonderful, my top tip, go to the Persian Garden in the morning. It's when it's at its quietest and to absolutely relax with the floor-to-ceiling windows, uh, hot stone beds. Oh, so, sorry to interrupt you, My time is up already. <laughs> no, 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 no. That means that we've not no. got one great celebrity deal. Yes. <laughs> we've actually yeah. got two. Yes. <laughs> I've never been cut off in my prime no. quite like that before on we, we, we always joke, because Ruth could talk for hours about celebrity. Oh, I could take up the rest of the show. But, well, you do have a last-minute exclusive deal tonight. We do, and it is absolutely exclusive to Planet Cruise. If you'd like to go somewhere a bit more exclusive, Exotic, a little bit further afield, 20 nights best of India and Sri Lanka, 
including all of India, the Arabian Peninsula, and over to Thailand and Singapore. Free classic drinks package, and it's only £150 to upgrade from balcony to aqua class. Right. There's very limited staterooms on now, this. Now, I was going to say, if you break this down, because you are getting, I'm right saying you get the classic drinks package. Yes. So you will. will get it with the balcony yes, and aqua class. Yes, and aqua class. It's working out just over £800 a week. It's unbelievable. That is yes, it that really is. is. Serious, isn't it? Traveling in March, beautiful weather, fabulous ship, recently refurbished. Um, and Singapore is just amazing. It is. Sorry, that is really good at home. It's an incredible right. deal and exclusive to yeah, Planet Cruise. But we've only got a few cabins left. Only a few. Literally. Ruth, thank you so much. You Cheers. were here 10 years ago. Let's hope we're all together in 10 Cheers. years. Cheers. Absolutely. Uh, by the way, Justin's doing dry January, okay? But Mary, <laughs> you put a little message on Facebook. You said, I have to drink tonight, so don't wear well. Cheers, Mary. <laughs> Me too. Cheers. Cheers. And well done, you. Hi. Thank you so much, Ruth. You're welcome. Um, amazing deals there. Right. That tastes very nice, actually. Yeah, very nice. Uh, now, our next cruise is with Princess Cruises. Uh, it's on board the Sun Princess. Again, we have got the most incredible price. Now, all the, you know, all the top cruise companies want us to be on this big show tonight, so they've all reduced their prices, given us exclusive deals. This is an 11-night Hong Kong and Vietnam to Singapore with some wonderful stops as well. So let's uh, have a little look at where we're going to be cruising to. We fly, first of all, from London over to Hong Kong, don't we, just Dave? Yeah. We're staying here, aren't we? Yeah, you get a two-night stay in Hong Kong. This is a fantastic city, absolutely amazing. Every night they have the world's largest light show. It's official, it's the Guinness Book of Records, and included in this particular price tonight, um, you've also got the Symphony of the Lights cruise, so you get a chance to go around oh, amazing, uh, the harbour. It? Yeah, it, it, the best way to see it is by the waterfront. Yeah. It's like Cow's Week down on the Isle of Wight. You've got to get out there and be on one of the ships. Can't be on shore. It's absolutely stunning. And bear in mind that on this particular cruise, that the first ten bookings from this evening's show will receive speciality dining included in the actual wow. uh, deal as well. So again, ten bookings for ten years. Um, it's a great deal, but uh, absolutely superb. It's one of those places that you could probably go back and spend you know, a couple of weeks, but what a great way to, to start your cruise, because this is before you're getting on board your ship. And again, this particular ship, I know her well. Uh, this is actually a ship that spent a little bit of time in the, uh, the P&O fleet. But look at the harbour there. You've got the old junker boats as well, fantastic uh, for all of the family. And, uh, you know, certainly a two-night stay in a five-star hotel with that tour included in the price. It's the January sale here at Planet Cruise. And certainly this is why uh, we're the number one with a lot of the top, uh, top cruise lines. Um, this is why we've been around for 10 and, years. And what Planet Cruise are really good at doing is putting together bespoke packages where mm. you've got the hotels, you've got the transfers, everything is organised. Well, so impeccably for you. I'm glad you said that because if you're looking at this and going, oh, do you know what? I'd love to do a little bit more. Now, I have got something for you at the end of this that you can book separately if you wish and make oh, yeah. it a trip of a lifetime. I mean, this is great, but if you want to extend it by a further 15 nights, then I'll tell you about that in a second. But anyway, take a look at the ship because Ooh, she's yes. absolutely stunning. Um, this is the, um, this is the Sun, Princess Sun Princess with yep. uh, our jade. So here she is. Regardless of which Princess Cruises ship you get on, you'll find yourself with a host of dining, entertainment and relaxation options to suit your needs. Whether you prefer the traditions of set time dining or you prefer to pick when, where and who you eat with, the option is yours on board a Princess ship. Princess Cruises have always taken speciality dining to the next level, from the sumptuous steaks in the Crown Grill through to the incredible Italian flavours of Sabatini's. The first of two new offerings is Steamer's Seafood, where you can feast on amazing shellfish, all accompanied by generous sides and dipping sauces. The second new taste sensation is Planks, serving up American-style barbecue options on Planks, loaded with four meats, chilli, coleslaw and fries, Oh, and some really incredible looking desserts. Princess Cruises love looking after the whole family during your cruise. Camp Discovery offers three different age categories and areas, all themed in collaboration with the Discovery Channel. Children aged 3 to 17 will have everything they need to keep them amused for hours at a time. Whichever Princess Cruises ship you go on, you are sure to find something entertaining happening. From the street performers in the piazza, through to the full Broadway style productions in the Princess Theatre. But this is Princess, so we can't talk about entertainment without mentioning the movies under the stars up here on deck. Whichever stateroom you pick, 
You'll get comfortable beds, a flat screen TV, mini bar and bathroom with shower. If you're looking for a bit of extra outside space, then an upgrade to a balcony is a must. For that touch of luxury though, suites are the perfect option, offering you extra space and amenities in your room and complimentary access to the Lotus Spa Thermal Suite, amongst other exclusive benefits. Uh, so yeah, thanks, Jake. Lovely, lovely ships. And by the way, we've got the details on the screen for the outside, but you can actually upgrade mm. to a balcony for just £100 tonight as well. Really amazing. Yeah. Um, but we've seen some fantastic places. Uh, it's uh, Nha Trang, first of all, isn't it? Yeah, yeah you're going into Vietnam, and this is the, the sort of beach capital of, of uh, Vietnam, of Thailand. Completely different place. Uh, but this, you can see crystal blue waters, absolutely superb facilities down on the beach. And uh, you know, everything, whether it's the temples, whether it's the, um, the service that you get, service is just fantastic in this part of the world. Any of them, we're off to uh, Ho Chi Minh City, or formerly known as Saigon. So you've got plenty of history to see here, the Notre Dame Square. Uh, of course, you've got the Sea Goddess Shrine as well. Um, so uh, plenty of things to do and uh, see and do um, in, uh, in Saigon or Ho Chi Minh. Um, then we're off for another relaxing day at sea before one of my favourite ports in this neck of the woods, Singapore. It's absolutely stunning. If you haven't done this before, I was talking to somebody uh, last week actually about Singapore, and it's one of those places that you just want to go back again and again and again because it is a city metropolis. The climate is absolutely stunning. You've got the gardens by the bay, which is just surreal to walk around, and especially the simple fact that you've got two nights here. Go down to the garden by the bay at night and see there's actually a zoo that you can go around in the evening so you can go and see all the animals there's great culture there but the food is just absolutely impeccable if you go for five star then of course you're going to pay that but what i'd recommend if you like trying take a little bit of a walk on the wild side then go to one of the the hawker markets and uh, there's a fantastic one down at newton and you've got to go and see a lady there called linda i know you, you think i'm joking but there's a lady there called linda <laughs> And there's about 22 different little hawker stalls, but she's fantastic. Every time that we go back to Singapore, I go back she's there. Still yeah, she's still there, and she looks after. She's absolutely fantastic, but you will love it. Um, then we're flying back to London, and uh, that wraps up 11 nights. However, if you want to extend it, I'll tell you about that in a second. Well, let's just have a final look at the fantastic Sun Princess. Um, as I mentioned, you've got an amazing place. Bear in mind, you've got your flights, you've got your hotel stays. Um, but if you want a balcony cabin, you can do that for just £100. But remember, yep. the first 10 bookings tonight yep. will receive speciality dining. Yeah, which is really nice. But um, So we are going to be super busy, so do make sure you give us a call sooner rather than later. Now, you've got the hotel stays. Uh, that's a two-night stay in a five-star hotel in Hong Kong and also a two-night stay in Singapore as well. The Symphony of Lights cruise, that is going to be wonderful, and that is included as well. And uh, also... Don't forget, you can actually extend this by... Yeah, do you, you want me to say about, about that? This? Yeah. So go on. Yeah, so this is, this is actually a 15-night overland tour that you can do. Um, and this takes in China. You get a three-night stay in Beijing. You get to see Tiananmen Square, the Forbidden City, the Summer Palace, the Great Wall of China. Then you get a three-night stay in Xi'an. You get to see the Terracotta Warriors, one of the great wonders of the world. Uh, and you get to see the, the mausoleum there as well. Then... It goes even further by giving you a four-night Yangtze River cruise. So you can go up the Yangtze um, and see the Three Gorges Dam. You can see giant pandas at one of the zoos there as well. And it doesn't stop there because then you get another two-night stay in Shanghai and another night in Hong Kong. All I'm going to say is that 15-night China land tour, fung the guys, and if you're interested in this cruise anyway, ask them about that because it is well worth it. Yeah. If you're going to go that distance... You might as well do yeah. all of it because you'll you'll wish you you'll come back and go. Sure. I wish we you know we were, we weren't that far you know to see the pandas the Great Wall of China uh, Tiananmen you Square. Might, you might Superb. just you might only go to that part of the world once in your life. And everyone said that is a crazy price. It's a brilliant price for the 15 night China land tour there. Um, again, give us a call. We can tell you more information about that. Now. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's not the end of shift. <laughs> no, it's not. No, no it's no, not crew, the end of the come camera. Back. The camera come crew were just about to walk <laughs> off. Right. <laughs> now it's getting close to February, and I'm feeling a bit rheumatic. Uh, I mean, romantic. <laughs> and uh, now, would you like to be in the Caribbean with your loved one or somebody else's um, for <laughs> Valentine's Day? I'd love that. That'd be brilliant. Somebody take my other half on Monday. <laughs>
Hey, my future ex-wife would love it. Um, but no, the 12th of February, all joking aside, if you're sat there and you're a little bit like me, you sort of like, you make out that you're not romantic, why not surprise her? Because you can get a fantastic t um, 13 nights Eastern Caribbean, and this is going from New York. Now, I'm not being funny, February in New York, it could be cold. And that means romance because they cuddle up and they want to keep nice and warm. When they're wandering around around uh, Central Park, you can get a little horse and carriage. Yeah. Have you done that? I have. Huh? Yeah. You see, you see? Nice and romantic. Well, I, uh, did, it, I did it with my mum, but, <laughs> <laughs> but she, did, she liked it. Bless her. <laughs> I don't know how to respond to that one. Because <laughs> um, I like you, Mum. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, you get, to see, you get to do all of the Caribbean as well. So, look, this is a last-minute Valentine's special. It sells on the 12th of February, so you're in the Caribbean for Valentine's. And this is with Norwegian Cruise Line. Now, bear in mind, if you want an upgrade as well on your drinks package, then you can do uh, to all-inclusive. Um, uh, just ask the guys when you phone up for that one. That's a really great price. That's brilliant. Yeah, really good. So... Um, He's say, romantic. Um, I come and go. <laughs> I can be romantic, but sometimes I can't be bothered, you know. But the thing is, you, I'm not being it is a Valentine's cruise, but you don't have to be romantic, do you? No. You know, go with whoever you want. Anyway, we're going to continue with our 10th anniversary show tonight and our January sale, of course. And, ah. Huh? Now, we've got we've got a Carnival cruise for you now, but it's their brand new ship, isn't it? And you see, the thing is, Carnival doesn't do the Mediterranean very often. No, they don't. And this is fantastic. It's the maiden season of the ship. You've got some fantastic... I mean, you know, it's the destination of fun. So you've got Skyrider, you've got the fantastic flumes there as well, and uh, a whole lot of action. It is fun, fun, fun all the way. And one of the things that I like about Carnival is a lot of their speciality restaurants. There are a few that additional fees apply, but you get so much included. So there's the uh, the Froyo ice cream, there's the burrito and tacos in the Blue Iguana, there's the burger joints, there's all of these different places that you can go to. And it's just fun, you know. It is, if you've ever done a carnival cruise in the Caribbean, then just try the Mediterranean. Because look, Barcelona, what a just, destination. Do you know what I'm amazed about? Normally, and you'll know if you're a regular cruiser, Normally, when it's a brand new ship and it's a maiden season, there is a you know more of a premium Ooh. price. This is a really low price. You're not what I forgot. Well, Hang on, I've got to say this to the viewers. Well, the first ten bookings will receive a Wi-Fi package. I cannot. Uh, some people, it, in fact, the camera, the camera crew are going, "What Wi-Fi?" Um, no, on board a cruise ship, it is great value to have that included because you want to be sharing and, your photos and with say, your family. It's, it's what they call the social Wi-Fi package, mm. so that's so you can share things on Facebook Facebook, and yeah, media, let, yeah, let everybody know where so you are, what you're up to. It's brilliant, really brilliant. Uh, anyway, um, yeah, we're flying over to Barcelona. Yeah, embarkation port, and then yeah. your first port of call, you're actually going off to Sardinia. Ooh. This is lovely. I love, I, I, you know, I love Corsica and Sardinia. Absolutely love it. Um, with this particular place, you've got some fantastic castles in the beachfront. The pizzeria is here, just fantastic. And the sandy beaches in Poeto is about 15 minutes from the centre. Look at that. The south of Italy is just absolutely stunning. Well, Sardinia is absolutely stunning. Then we're heading off uh, to the mainland. We're off, we're off to the boot. Uh, we're off to Naples. Now, this is the hustle and bustle. Um, just imagine a Vespa scooter just tooting its horn, and that, that is, it's just the hustle and bustle. It is brilliant. But there's so much to do here. All I'd say is, if you've never been to Naples before, when you book this, ask about the additional um, excursions, because you can get to Pompeii, you can get to Herculania, Mount Vesuvius, get to Capri. There's so many places that you can go to. Talking of places, this is a destination in itself. Sivasha Vecchia, Rome. This is the port of call where you will transfer and again book a tour. We can do that for you and it saves the hassle and it saves time. When you get on board the ship, the last thing you want to be doing is queuing at the tours desk or going to the port lectures. Book it with Planet Cruise, it's done and dusted, and you don't miss out the spaces then. And you know, all, all of these wonderful places, you know, the, the, the Vatican City, um, um, the uh, Colosseum. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't think of it then. There you go, there's the Colosseum. Uh, the Vatican, uh, uh, Spanish Steps, Trevi Fountain, all of that. Mm. Uh, then we're off to um, Florence and Pisa from Livorno. Yes, so again, this is the port of course. So Livorno is the actual port and you can transfer into uh, Florence and Pisa. You can do it all in a day and again, then you go and see the Ponte Vecchio Bridge, go and see our David um, and uh, go and see the Leaning Tower as well. It's definitely worth going to. Then we round it off with a nice tonic to these busy days and that is Marseille. It's the gateway to Provence. 
and it's a lovely south of France feel, you know, just slower paced life, glass of rose. Not that I'm thinking about. There is some dry January, remember, um, halfway through. It's just, just, it's just a beautiful port to finish off. And then back to Barcelona and flying home. But again, can't emphasize it enough. The free social Wi Fi package that we're giving for the first 10 bookings um, is phenomenal. Again, celebrate the 10 years. Of Planet Cruise here on uh, Ideal World. Sorry, that I'm, I'm looking at the ship. It, uh, yeah, look, it's made in wow. season. The the actual venues that you've got on board. Everybody thinks that, that Carnival can be can be a, bit, a little bit loud, a little bit bright. This is incredible, absolutely incredible. For for the kids, they will yeah. absolutely love it. They will absolutely love but it. But there's many many wonderful adult areas in that one as well. Now. Um, as you mentioned, it is our, as you probably know by now, it is our 10th anniversary special. The first 10 bookings will receive that social Wi-Fi package you'll be able to connect with Facebook and things like that. Um, you're going to be some of the very first to sail on the ship, some of the very, very first, and she's going to be amazing. You can add on um, extra nights in Barcelona from just £60 per person. Oh, do that. £60 per person? Yeah, definitely. No right. word of a lie. I was looking at, at uh, hotels in Barcelona. Admittedly, it was in February, and it was around 100 to £130 pounds for a hotel room. So just please go and do yeah. your own research on that. That is great value for sixty pounds. That is I definitely brilliant. do that. And return flights are included as well. Uh, we've got a few dates on this. We've got a couple of dates for you. So just to show you, nothing in them really. So just uh, you know, slight difference in price on the balcony on. and the, the, the suite. That's a maiden season. Yeah. Of a carnival ship in the Mediterranean, which it hasn't done for a long yeah. time. And that balcony starts at 699. I know. Brilliant. I'll be going for yeah. the suite. So I always want to go on the I'll new ships, for... but they are expensive to start with, normally. I'll go for the suite. Look yeah. at that price. That yeah. is brilliant for a suite. Anyway, anyway um, as I say, tonight is a very special show. <laughs> hey, somebody left the toaster on. <laughs> what could that be? What? It could be not one carnival deal, but two. Uh, we're bringing this, and I absolutely love this one. Absolutely. Fancy going to Vegas for three nights and then hitting the Mexican Riviera. Margarita, 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 then floor. Um, that is an awesome, what a great, three nights in Vegas and then the Mexican Riviera. With um, Carnival. Now again, I know we've been quite quick with these, but as the call centre, they'll know exactly which cruises we're talking about. And we also have, look at that cheeky one at the end there, full six nine for a seven night Northern European cruise from Southampton. That's with MSC. And that does include an overnight on board in Amsterdam as well. So uh, uh, they all have the little ID numbers there. So do jot those down. It will make it even easier to book those, don't forget. So uh, the Vegas one there is 153934. And the MSC is 129217. Now, oh my word, seriously, I think the next it, it, it is a great show. But we've got Morella next yeah. on their latest ship. Yeah, and, and again, for those of you that are, are big Thompson Cruises fans or Tui fans, this is now uh, the new name for Thompson Cruise, and this is Morella. So for those of you, because uh, these usually sell out, these these are usually our best-selling cruises. So, um, Morella, the same name, the same family welcome or friendly welcome, as I say there. But it is it's the same ships. Um, it's just been rebranded. Yeah. So all, I, I, no doubt, I expect that the crew will be all, all the same. Um, it will be a great experience. Now, um, there's two very important words on the screen. I yeah, think. Barbados. <laughs> Barbados. No! I it's... love Barbados. The two most important words for me are that all-inclusive. Yeah, and don't forget, the first 10 bookings to celebrate our 10 years here at Planet Cruise will receive a bottle of sparkling yeah. wine as well. But anyway. Um, this is their latest ship, then? Yeah. 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 And the, the great thing about this is, again, uh, you've got fantastic facilities as well. Ten restaurants, ten bars. This, I'm not joking. This is not like a ten-year special. Ten restaurants, ten bars. You've got surf and turf steakhouses, lobster and pork shops. Oh, Coral R as well. You've got to go. All, all of the Tom's, the Morella ships have got uh, the, the Coral R Asian Fusion. It is just Lovely. fantastic as well. Um, and just the, di the just the basic dining rooms are great. Always, because uh, um, Keith was a big fan of Thompson Cruises, um, the, the entertainment on board is superb. Yeah. It's I mean, absolutely superb. The, the shows that, you know, it's West End Broadway style shows, um, it really is And excellent. I mean, we know this will, will fly tonight because it's got all of your tips, gratuities, your drinks included. You're making your way over to, of mm. course, the Caribbean, so you're going to get great weather. Yeah. It works out just over £600 a week. Yeah, well, that's £84 per person uh, per night. Deposit is just £75 per person. And I'm telling you now, for those of you that are in Birmingham, 
um, or in Manchester, we can do you supplement flights there from only forty pounds per person. Wow. Hey, so that just is just superb. Look at the ship. I, I know. Mean, ooh. I love it. some of these new venues that they've put on board are just wow, brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Wow. And again, a lot of people think because it's an older ship. Bear in mind, you, you're only looking at seventy-six thousand tons on this one, so it's a smaller ship. A lot of people think that you know it's an old ship. No, when they do these refits. Amazing, like yeah. In incredible decor. I mean, look at the spa that you've got there. I actually, I'm really tempted with this one. I, I really am, actually, because that's a, I, I don't really like October. You know, it's all, the clock's change, it gets all dark. It's all, what are you looking at me like that? You, no, you, you haven't got enough holiday. You haven't got, you, you never, it's almost as if this <laughs> is your holiday. Don't encourage and your, anyway. Don't the crew all nodding away there. Um, <laughs> There's Which always... crew? The crew on the ship. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, um, that is seriously tempting, isn't it? We do think it'll sell very quickly tonight. First ten buckets will book it. <laughs> Bookings rather will Shake. receive a bottle of sparkling wine. No but... more wine for that man. <laughs> but look, Mary said I had to drink tonight. Yeah. Okay. Um, it's very low alcohol, though, honestly. Uh, so we, we're flying to Parma, aren't we? Yeah, flying to Parma. First port of call, though, is in Cartagena. We're, we're talking Spain, and this is fantastic. Great history here, uh, dating back to the Punic War, and this is some of the best beaches in, uh, in the region as well. There's 100, 175 miles of beaches around this area. But to be fair, you've got fantastic uh, culture in the actual city itself, the town. Then we're off to Malaga. Again, quintessential Spanish uh, tapas sort of uh, country here. Um, and with this, you can head off into Andalusia as well. Uh, so, you know, home to Picasso, uh, yeah. home to uh, Antonio Banderas as well. So, uh, you know, a lot of culture there. Then we're off to Cadiz. Do you know, we haven't done Cadiz for a long time. A long, long time. And you've got the Alcazar Fort here. It's a Moorish fort that dates back to the 13th century. In fact, before then. Actually, 913, I think. Uh, you've got the Cathedral of Seville as well. You've got all of the wonderful uh, sherry bodegas as well. And, um, yeah, definitely one to, to get out and see. Get out and see. Then we're starting to head across. And we're talking now over to the Canaries and to Madeira. One of my favourite ports. One of your faves, isn't it? I yeah. love this place. Brilliant. The steak on the stone in the harbour is just off the chart. Off the chart. It is brilliant. Um, oh, so, you made me feel really hungry there. Yeah, yeah, and there's plenty of sea and do. Lovely climate as well. Very green, lush island. And um, have and a little get, wander around the streets as well. And they do get pretty much great temperatures all year round, don't they? Yeah, yeah. But this is where it starts. This is the best way to travel to the Caribbean. No, no, no long flights on this one. You are travelling the right way across because you are gaining an hour every night, as in getting an hour back in your pocket. And your first port of, port of call is Antigua. And those, those five days at sea... Um, oh. Or several days at sea, I should say. Every day should get warmer and warmer, shouldn't it? Yeah, but just, just think, yeah. out on board, you know, if, if you love cruising, I'm, I'm going to say cruising, not just port, 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 port. This is brilliant yeah. because you've got ports at the beginning, loads of time to chill out on the ship and just unplug, and then Caribbean. Antigua, you've got Nelson's Dockyard here, you've got Stingray City, you've got Shirley Heights as well. And if you want to do activities, this is one of the best ports to call. Definitely. 365 beaches. For 365 days of the year, I'm in for that. Um, then we're off to St Lucia. Now, of course, St Lucia is dominated by the pitons, so you can travel up into uh, the pitons. A good friend of mine recommends uh, Salfrey, which is the oldest establishment, when I say establishment, established uh, colony uh, on the island. Pigeon Point's great up at the north of the island as well. And of course, you can't go to St Lucia without going to Marigo Bay. It's where they filmed Doctor Doolittle, the original. You know, with a giant pink sea snail. You try saying that after a glass of wine. <laughs> anyway, then we're off to the Spice Island of Grenada. Now, this is, again, you can go on one of the tours, uh, which encompasses what they call black gold, which is the peppers and the spices of this wonderful island. Uh, my personal choice would be go to Grand Anne's Bay. Ah, uh, it's literally just a, a short water taxi. Don't get a land taxi, get a water taxi. Go Caribbean style. Get there and think, wow, I'm glad that, that that's over. Honestly, it's crazy. You get in these old wooden boats and you, you head round to the beach and then there's seven miles of beach. Oh, it is God. just heaven, absolute heaven. Then you're heading back to Barbados and then I'm afraid you do have to come home. I well, mean, look, 15 nights, look at that price. I know. What would a flight cost you to Barbados? I mean, it would be 700 pounds, wouldn't it? Yeah, again, we are, and I asked the Remember, question. you've got all of your drinks for 15 nights. Yeah. Uh, I can't believe it's all inclusive, actually. And uh, don't forget the first 10 bookings also receive a bottle of sparkling wine. 
Um, all your tips for 50 nights, they're included. Return flights based on London Gatwick, but as Justin mentioned, really important. So a lot of our viewers live uh, in Manchester and central Birmingham there, uh, starting at just £40 per person. They do go very quickly, those, those flights. So if you do want to book this one, I'd do it now. And Justin, you mentioned the deposit. Did you say £75? Pounds? £75 pounds per person. Wow. Yeah. It's great. Just, yeah. just get the deposit in October, later on this year. Just put, start putting the money aside. Uh, Again, I, all inclusive. Look at the price that you're paying. I, and, and that's their latest ship as well. I think that one is amazing. I think that, yeah. seriously, I think that one will go tonight. So if you do want to book, do it now sooner rather than later. That's a really, yeah. Do you know, we've got so much choice. Oh, oh hang on. on. Here we go again. We've got so much <laughs> choice tonight. And in fact, um, we're going to go. Now, not down Conversation Street, but to Luxury Corner. Now, um, I, I was really intrigued with this one because it's with Oceania Cruises, and I've actually been on board the ship, the Riviera. She is stunning. Now, we don't feature Oceania very, very often. They have a premium luxury brand. Yeah. Um, they include things like speciality restaurants, uh, butlers with, with many of the staterooms. What you're getting tonight, and, and I was very lucky, I actually stayed in one of the penthouse suites, the price for the penthouse, and they are, they're huge, they are wonderful, is under £2,400. The balcony is just 1849 and you can go concierge, concierge rather, oh, I've had too much of that, just to have that. Uh, concierge for under £2,000. Now, you're going to get free gratuities and you're going to get free Wi-Fi, and you can also choose from either free drinks, free $400 on board spend, or free excursions as well, and return flights. So that is a brilliant job. choice. If you've got something really special this year, I would look into the Penthouse Suite because that's the best price that I think I've ever seen for that. Yeah. I, all, all joking aside, I know I, I, know I like to, to laugh and joke about it, but this is what the, the cruise industry experts aspire to. Um, that's yeah, the yeah. sort of level of luxury and quality. And look, I'm not even, if I said to you, I've just been on holiday to Monte Carlo. We popped into Saint Tropez. Uh, we popped into Marseille just for an afternoon. Uh, Provence uh, and uh, Sardinia, Sicily. It's it's that jet set yeah. lifestyle that gives you an idea of the quality that you're going to be getting on board. And again, I can't emphasize it enough. We only bring you these deals from Oceania when they are yeah. this low, and, because and, they're not usually. <laughs> and honestly, if you can upgrade to the penthouse, you'll be you'll be just amazed. They are beautiful. They are, but. That's one of the best deals we've ever, ever had. Do you know, now, what, my, do you know what my favourite Oceana story is? Um, oh, um, I, I don't know what I can say. There's two, two, two people that we, we oh, know very well. I don't say it. Go on, it's funny, is this one. They, 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 they came back off of Oceana Cruise it's, and they it's said, two, I can't... Two, pres two presenters here at Iderwell. Very, very well not, known. Not me. And they actually said, you know what? Sit to the death of the sight of lobster and champagne. <laughs> First world problems. No. First world problems. No, do you know what I thought the funniest thing was? They never got off the ship there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a, yeah. They never didn't get got off the, the ship. ship, and then they were there. Yeah. I couldn't. I can't get another lobster. The ship was so beautiful. Really? They never got off the ship. My favourite restaurant ever, Red Ginger on board, and the specialty restaurants are included. Anyway, we've got one final cruise for you, and it's a lovely yeah. uh, mini cruise with Saga on board the Saga Sapphire. And again, this is this is a cruise line that we don't usually no. feature. We've brought it to you in not only the Planet Cruise January sale, but also the 10th anniversary special. Um, their ships are fantastic. And again, this is for those of you that like intimate small ships. We're talking 37,000 tonnes. That's it. That's oh, it is just super. You are maximum, and the, the crew to, to passenger ratio, two crew to every three uh, passengers. Two crew to every three pass passengers. Really? That is superb service. And the great thing is, I mean, you've got great restaurants on board. You've got East to West, uh, which is uh, one of the speciality restaurants, which is Asian themed. You've got the veranda, you've got the grill as well. Um, and for a special treat on board, I mean, you've got your afternoon teas and everything that you can just enjoy. But you know, quintessential British cruising. Um, you've got the Britannia Lounge there, which comes to live in the evening with live music. Um, and there's just, just great. A great atmosphere on board. By the way, for those of you as well that are fans of Saga, we're also um, going to give you the opportunity, if you wish, um, to to uh, take up their insurance oh, as yes. well. So for those of you and that you know do struggle, whether it's medical conditions or your or your age, uh, ask about the insurance as well because we can include that for you. Uh, now, just so you know, the first five bookings will receive a champagne a bottle of champagne, I should say. And is this all inclusive? This one as well. Not too sure. <laughs> I'll check that for you. I'll give, give me a couple of seconds. But one of the things that I love um, for, for this yeah. one 
is um, oh sorry, yeah, it it's is, all yeah, inclusive, it all inclusive. Sorry, I was getting distracted because it is door to door well, chauffeur. Well, this is what I love about this. Well, seriously, I looked and thought, is it really all inclusive? I, Sorry, I, I, thought, I was no. getting to that because it said door-to-door -door chauffeur, and then it said yeah. all inclusive. No, but I couldn't believe. No, seriously, I couldn't believe you got all of that though either. But uh, you do tonight. Sure, um, leave me like it's a busy show. Right? <laughs> Thirteen cruises, never been done before in ten years. <laughs> but amazing deals. Uh, seriously, we, we we had loads of other you know offers that wanted to come on the show, but we we had to cherry pick and we got the best ones tonight. Um, now, it's, uh, it's a lovely mini cruise, a lovely taste cruise, or an extra cruise. We start off in Southampton, of course, well, on this in one. In fact, sorry, can I just point out, you start off at your doorstep with oh. somebody picking you up and taking you to say, I love that. That's, yeah, I love, yeah. I mean, that's the way to do it, isn't it? it I mean, usually, you know, if, if I work anywhere else, that's the, the sort of uh, level of service that I'm expected to. But, you know, we're sure to make an exception. Anyway, um, oh, you can have Southampton. Park, if you prefer to drive, you can have free parking instead. No, I'll be driven. Um, <laughs> then we're off to Bruges. We're off to Zeebrugge. Um, and it's only a short ride into Bruges, the fantastic canals and the incredible selection of chocolates and beer. You wouldn't think the two go together, but they do oh, they in Bruges. Do. Yeah. And there's 125 breweries in Bruges, or in Belgium, um, and the chocolate here is incredible. Absolutely incredible. There's chocolate liqueurs that you can, you can bring back to put on um, ice cream. I'll tell you what, in the summer, get that in the freezer. Oh, it's lovely. Then we're off to Amsterdam. We touched, touched on this earlier on. Amsterdam, and this is overnight on board. I thought we're running out of time, so I haven't got all of the, uh, the things that you can do in Amsterdam. Um, a few of the highlights, of course, will be Anne Frank's Memorial and uh, the Rembrandt Museum as well, uh, the Van Gogh Museum. Yes, definitely. And uh, one of the cycle parks as well. They have a multi-story cycle park. Um, and if you want to do some window shopping or hit the cafes, uh, then you can do. And can I just say something? Amsterdam in the evening is not what you expect. It's, it's one of the most beautiful places down by the waterfront. Yes, of course, there are areas that you might want to visit and then come out of. Um, but, you know, go and, go and experience it. That's what you've got to go and do. I have one of the best overnights on board ever in Amsterdam. And f bizarrely, it was the onboard pianist dragged me into a bar and there was there was a piano there and he started playing the piano and we didn't pay for a drink all night oh brilliant it's fantastic anyway um, and then, of course bring back some tulips and then back to southampton yeah. now remember uh, it, it is all inclusive you will get that door-to-door -door show for service as well i think mean, they're going to really look after you and a really beautiful small intimate ship as yep. well so let's just remind you uh, obviously for the over 50s of course um so we are looking at First of all, the first five bookings will receive a bottle of champagne in their cabin, so it's a lovely start there. Free door-to-door -door show for service, or you can go for parking, Justin is definitely going for that door-to-door uh, -door service there, and it is all inclusive as well. And as we mentioned earlier, you can go for Saga's optional travel insurance as well. We can add that, just call for details. Um, wow, now we, um, we are nearly out of time. I it's know. been a great show. Should we recap? Yeah. Oh, hang on. Oh, no, no. I, no, I can't do another one. I can't do it. I'm all out. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. No, but I'm so, there's always room for one more cruise. Oh, go on, on then. Go on then. Um, bonus deal. And, it, <laughs> and it's a bonus deal from Saga um, starting there at just 555. And it's on board the Saga Sapphire there. Uh, it's a lovely uh, maritime heritage cruise from Dover there. Uh, in June as well, it'll be really nice. And uh, again, all the extras are there, including the daughter of show service, uh, and also all inclusive as well. So does um, Guernsey as well there? So it goes from Dover to Pittsburgh, Guernsey, and Portsmouth as well. Overnight on Dover. board as well. Yeah. Overnight in Portsmouth. Very nice. But before we run out of time, we'd better do a very, very quick recap. We started off, of course, with PO, the seven night Spain, Portugal, and Guernsey cruise there. 539 and the first 10 bookings get of course that bottle of wine. Uh, every cruise has its own ID number as well, don't forget. Uh, this one is 155954. Then it was Celebrity, wasn't it? Yeah, it was Celebrity Cruises and of course Ruth joined us for this one. This is on board the fantastic silhouette, one of her favourite. And Scandinavia and Russia is one of the best selling itineraries for Celebrity. You get the free classic drinks package when booking Ocean View and above and you also get your par uh, port parking fantastic itinerary on this one and uh, you can enter our prize draw for a chance to win yes. a mini cruise for two on board the celebrity select see the, the website for more details on that one ID number 130364 then we had princess cruises on board the Sun Princess there wonderful 11 night Hong Kong and Vietnam cruise um, and loads on this one don't forget the Hong Kong stay you've also got the two nights in Singapore the Symphony of Lights 
uh, cruise tour and a free upgrade to inside to outside as well. And that one, uh, there is 160345. That was really good, actually. Yeah, then, of course, Carnival returning to the Mediterranean with a brand new ship. This is a maiden season on the fantastic uh, Carnival Horizon. You can add on a Barcelona hotel stay from just £60 per person on that one. Just fantastic. And remember, the first 10 bookings will receive a social Wi-Fi package. Then we had that amazing deal with Morella Cruises, and it, it truly was amazing. I think you'll agree. Um, Carnival got uh, it's a great price there, but Morella 15 night, all inclusive, all inclusive tips, all of your drinks, and that price is just one two five nine. If you want flights from Manchester or Birmingham, give us a call super quick for those because they're just forty pound supplement. But it was Saga, wasn't it? Yeah, we don't get usually a chance to feature Saga, but we have tonight, and this is a four night cruise over to Amsterdam. Fantastic overnight, and I do all joking aside, love the fact that you have got door to door chauffeur service, and you get your first five bookings will receive a bottle of champagne on this one, and there is an option to uh, book Saga's optional travel insurance as well. Uh, now, we had a few sale deals and late deals. Oh, yes, we'll, we'll blow the whole one final time. The Valentine's special, remember, with Norwegian Cruise Line, uh, to pass on the 12th of February, and the prices there, I think, are absolutely amazing. That's an Eastern Caribbean cruise from New York there. And the ID for that one is 113171. Then we had Oceania as well. Yeah, luxury we? corner on this one. Seven nights from Monte Carlo on one of the most incredible cruise lines and ships uh, aboard the ocean waves. Uh, you can choose from either free drinks, $400 on board spend, or free excursions on this one as and well. And honestly, if you can go for the penthouse, it is amazing. And then Saga, they've given some great deals tonight, but there's a little extra one here, which is the cruise taking you to Guernsey, Portsmouth overnight there, all inclusive, starting at just 555. But any of the cruises we featured, just give us a call, don't forget, on 08025026622. Um, now, I want to say a massive thank you to every single viewer that watches every week and that's been with us for many years. Some of you have been with us since day one, so thank you. We are back next week, but I want to also say a big thank you to Kat, who's the TV executive producer with Planet, who puts it all together. <laughs> Kat, cheers. Thank you so much. Chin, chin. Here's to another 10 years. Thank you, seriously. <laughs> we love you, Kat. We love what you do. Yeah, and honestly, Kat really looks after us all and helps put the whole show together. Um, Give us a call. I know we're exceptionally busy, but amazing deals. We are back next week. Just a thank you to you as well. Absolute Great pleasure. Time. We'll Absolute see you next week. Yeah. yeah. Hopefully another 10 years' time too. <laughs> All right. We'll see you next Tuesday with Gatmas Fellows.